stare on their face, if their mouth is twitching a lot, those are reasons to believe they're schizophrenia. Mm -hmm. Or if they're always paranoid, they can't interact with a lot of people. Yeah. And and I believe that it is so, so spiritual. Oh, absolutely. That it, it takes stages of deliverance. After you've tried the medicine, after every, you've done everything you know how to do, you must seek deliverance from a church that does pray, cancel, and will walk you through your deliverance. Yes. Because this is a, a serious disease because of the psychotic symptoms. Right, and it, ta it requires a lot of steps that has to be made and taken by your church and you to be fully delivered from this quote-unquote uh, demonic oppression. oppression. And as I was studying, it also said that it's associated with shamanism. Mm. Well, shamanism. Because they can travel in their minds, mm -hmm. step mm -hmm. out of their bodies into places that they're not familiar with. Mm -hmm. So this is a very, very serious disease. It's shocking. It's confusing. Mm -hmm. It changes the person's behavior, changes their appearance, because they take on this form of being delusional and mad, where they won't comb their hair, they won't change their clothes, and they start, uh, uh, some of them become cutters. So it is very serious, and we want to take the time out to just talk about it um, compassionately from our heart. Yes. Because this is um, very dear to us because we want every person to be aware of those signs. I mean, you may just think that, oh, this child is acting out. Just just watch the child or watch the adult to see what's really going on. Take a look. Yes. And you, you will know because you will feel it that something yes. is not quite right. Yes. But stay tuned after these messages. We're going to give you some more handy tips and information on this topic. Thank you.